This is Sarah Starlight. Today I'm going to be presenting the August 2016 Spooky Squared software update and this is the quick start video. Let's get started. The first thing I want to show you is the simple mode. In simple mode we see four different screens. The preset screen, program screen, generator control screen, and error screen. Let's go ahead and click on Shell Empty Presets. Here are the names of all the different presets. Let's go ahead and click on Killing Remote JW. We see in the Notes section all kinds of information on Killing Remote JW. Let's go ahead and click on Program Screen. Let's type in Headache. Under Headache, we see there are 62 different options. Let's go ahead and click on Headache Toxicity Number 1. Notice how under Loaded Programs, Headache Toxicity Number 1 is located as well as under Program Description. Let's go ahead and click on the Generator Control screen. Click on Generator 3. Here's the start button, and here are all the different frequencies that are run under headache toxicity number one. Here's again the start button. Here's a button that resumes the generator at the point where it was last running. There's the start button. Let's go ahead and click it. Here's the stop button. To the right of the stop button, we see a button that says click to stop a looping program after the current loop has completed. Let's go ahead and click that button. Let's unclick it. Let's click stop. Now we see that the generator is now red, meaning it stopped. Let's go ahead and click on errors. There's two different places to check for errors, both in the error screen as well as the very bottom where you see RE0. It's another place to check for errors. Let's go back to preset screen. Let's click on show advanced options. Under show advanced options we see, we see options for seven different screens. We see preset screen, program screen, generator settings, generator control screen, global settings, internet screen, and error screen. There's an option to get rid of the internet screen by going to global settings and unclicking show internet tab. There are also other options under general settings enable system sounds, write program log, as well as changing the number of generators you're using. Let's go click go ahead and click on the preset screen. Let's go to more gallons and lime. Let's click on Remote 4-01 Generator 4BY. And again, we see in the Notes section there's all kinds of information on this preset. And on the Program section, we see all the different programs that are run in this preset. Let's click on the Program screen again. And under Loto Programs, here we have all the different programs that are going to run in this particular preset. Under Program Options, you can change all kinds of different options. Change how much to repeat each set, etc. Let's go to Generator Settings screen. Here's the Signal Settings. Here's the Wobble Settings. Reduce Amplitude. And here you can change the Waveform. Let's go to Generator Control Settings screen. Let's click on Allow Channel Overwrites. Allow Overwrite. Click on Generator 3. And here are all the different frequencies again. Let's go to Global Settings screen. Here are all the different general settings under Global Settings. Here is the internet screen. You can email somebody if you want right here. And again, the error screen.
Thank you so much for watching. This has been a production of Ed V and Sarah Starlight. One more thing I want to note is under notes section, you can you can put in notes here of which person um, DNA is under which different generator if you wish. Thanks for watching. Blessed be.